The intermediate ProPath editor has been enhanced to give you absolute confidence in the accuracy of your intermediate ProPaths. PowerInspect automatically updates the intermediate ProPath to avoid any collisions. So, if we begin by creating an inspection sequence, click on the Create Inspection Group icon on the left hand side and begin to create some probe points on the CAD model. Change the probing strategy to Optimal and click the green tick to accept. OK, I'm now going to create a second inspection group. Again, changing the probing strategy to optimal. We can now see that there's a collision in the sequence. As the session runs down the sequence tree from inspection group 21 to inspection group 22, the probe will collide with the CAD part. As normal, this is highlighted by a brown star in PowerInspect. To prevent this happening, we need to create an intermediate probe path. So the first thing we need to do is move the cursor in the sequence tree so that it's between the two inspection groups. And now we can click on the mis miscellaneous toolbar from the left hand toolbar and select the intermediate probe path icon. At this point, PowerInspect automatically regenerates the intermediate path so that any collision with the part is avoided. This will give you absolute confidence in the probe path and the path's updated automatically without you needing to do anything. So if we quickly move to the Run tab, you can see that the path is now collision-free and there aren't any problems with our inspection sequence.